Did you know that St. Augustine said the New Testament is hidden in the Old and the Old Testament is unveiled in the New? Today is extra special because we make the connection about the resurrection on Easter Sunday and the creation in Genesis for our fun fact section after the Gospel reading. Welcome to the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew. After the Sabbath, as the first day of the week was dawning, Mary Magdalene and the other Mary went to see the tomb, and suddenly there was a great earthquake. For an angel of the Lord descending from heaven, came and rolled back the stone, and sat on it. His appearance was like lightning, and his clothing white as snow. For fear of him the guards shook and became like dead men. But the angel said to the women, Do not be afraid, I know that you are looking for Jesus who was crucified, he is not here. For he has been raised as he said. Come, see the place where he lay. Then go quickly and tell his disciples. He has been raised from the dead. And indeed he is going ahead of you to Galilee, there you will see him. This is my message for you. So they left the tomb quickly with fear and great joy, and ran to tell his disciples. Suddenly Jesus met them and said, Greetings. And they came to him, took hold of his feet, and worshipped him. Then Jesus said to them, Do not be afraid, go and tell my brothers to go to Galilee. There they will see me. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. And now, it's time for our fun facts. Do you know what Easter is about? Easter is not just about Easter egg hunts and bunnies. During Easter, we remember that Jesus came into the world to make all things new and to usher in a new creation. You see, in the Old Testament, when the earth was covered with darkness, God said, let there be light, and God makes the old creation starting with the light on the first day. In the New Testament, Jesus conquered the darkness of sin and death by rising from the grave on the first day of the week. Easter Sunday ushered in a new creation with the resurrection. And just like St. Justin Martyr says, we all gather on the day of the sun, for it is the first when God, separating matter from darkness, made the world. And on the same day, Jesus Christ our Savior rose from the dead. Now it's time for a transfiguring discussion. Jesus fulfilled his promise. He said after three days he would rise again. Do you trust that God will fulfill his promises? Thanks for watching. See you all next week. Thank you so much for subscribing. God loves you and he has an eternal plan for you and your family.